Hello. It's been a while. I haven't filmed anything for a while, so I figured I'd film this one. I've been working. Yeah, just to show you. I've been working on. Put a roof. You see it? Put a roof on the bird cage. That bird cage. Bird table for my little girl. I'm gonna do an independent video for that one. And you can just see that, that contraption there. That there is um, bracket football. That's what I've been doing this morning. Uh, put you back before I make you all sick. We see sickness and shaking about. Right, so it's what is it now? Oh, good God, it's half, five past one. Five past one, Saturday afternoon. Right, so the plan for this after. I got contacted ages ago. If you follow, follow my builds, or if you look back in my, uh, if you look back in my um, videos, you'll find uh, find one called Coleman. It's Coleman Part One, Coleman Part Two. Um, when I did those, I got contacted by another chap after I posted them on Facebook, and it's not recording. Yes, it is. Oh, it's bad enough. Um, yeah, the chap contacted me after I posted them on Facebook. Um, after I posted the Coleman on Facebook. And he he wants me to build him some. He wants me to build a model. Sculpture. I hate calling them sculptures. I'm not a sculptor. I'm not good enough. Um, anyway, the guy, he's um, an artist, a painting artist. And he's nicknamed the Umbrella Artist. I think I've mentioned this before in previous videos, stuff I'm going to do. So that's my intention today. He wants a, a sculptor. Um, he wants an artist. Stood at an easel. And he'd go up in an umbrella somewhere. So... What I've got, nice big fat plates. I like making stuff that's really heavy. So my intention is to, I'm gonna get another one. I've got some more over there. Two like that. Can you see? I'll turn it that way, I'll turn it down a bit. Oh, that's a bit better, isn't it? So I'm gonna weld two together like that and flush them off. And then I'm gonna weld the third one on top. Like that. So it looks kind of like a pedestal. And I'm gonna put him on the pedestal on top here. So, I'm going to use, because it wants it quite tall, I'm going to use rebar to make the body, rather than just using uh, normal round bar. And then, I use loads of these for bits and pieces, I keep showing you them. It's um, gas bottles I use for the MIG, CO2 gas, and that's just a base that I cut off eons ago, obviously off a full one. So, I figured I could make a nice little umbrella like that. My intention is to have it sat. I intend having the artist like that with umbrella. Umbrella wizard. And then painting away. Easel made up. I've got some square bar. Some nice square bar. That's the thing that's left over from what it's a tie fighter. So I'm going to make up a <coughs> canvas. A bit of flat plate. And then I'll use some round bar, make up the easel tripod type thingy, bob, jobby, doofer. And I've got some piano wire, that all wrap around there. See how it goes. Let's catch you soon. Bye. <laughs>
So there we are, Umbrella Artist. That was a pain in the butt. You'll, uh, you'll see that I changed Umbrella. Um, quite frankly, my, uh, my wife is my biggest critic and she came in and she saw that umbrella and she says it looks like a parasol it don't look like an umbrella it looks like a parasol chop it off right away start again that didn't work i was going to i was going to write the umbrella artist on it but it, as soon as i started it just blew a hole straight through it so no. i got binned i didn't have another any more square bar so I couldn't make another one, so I just chopped a piece of bar, flat bar. It looks okay, it does the job. So same with the, uh, the Umbra Ruvella. Um I can see I just scored the lines because you know, I didn't have any more ram bar. So anyway, I'm not enough. So there we are, the Umbrella Artist. You can't really see it very well. Can't really see it in detail. Let's bring it down. There you go. See him? That's two part epoxy, so that look quite cool. Put some dribbles on off the umbrella as well. Yeah, apparently the story goes for the umbrella artist. It's a chap called I think it's called Malcolm. He um he's an artist, like I said, he's a painter. And every every piece of work he does um, it's raining in in the art. That's that's his thing. So he got nicknamed the Umbrella Artist, hence the being an umbrella on it. So I think all in all, it's come out okay. Very happy with how the figure came out. Very happy with the little brush that I did. Easel itself is fine. Base is fine. That pissed me off. That pissed me off. Well, the wife pissed me off. No, she didn't. Well, it's done. It's made. It's finished. I'll get some foam sticky pads on the bottom to protect everything. And it weighs a ton. Well, there we go. Another one built. I'll message the guy, send him some photos, see what he has to think. See ya. I will catch you on the next build. I have no idea what that's going to be because nothing's going to plan on it. Mucky teeth again. I ingest all this dust. Anywho, ladies and gentlemen, I will leave you to it. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I will catch you on the next build. Take care. Bye bye.